Hi friends. In this video, we will see how to mark in or out punches using QR code. Matrix Cosec platform is an enterprise grade web enabled application server which controls and manages the entire system and gives opportunity to access all time attendance information from anywhere at any time. Matrix Cosec offers multiple ways in which employees can mark their attendance which gets recorded in the system. It is entirely dependent on how flexible the architecture of an organization is. For instance, in manufacturing units, punches can be marked automatically, while in the areas where Cosec devices cannot be reached, punches can be marked easily using QR code. To scan the QR code, one can use the primary camera of an Android or iOS based mobile device. Let's go through the configuration. First ensure that ESS account is enabled for the user and the IMEI number is registered. For this go to users module. Select the user from the list. and enable the ESS account. To enable the ESS account of multiple users, go to user configuration then ESS and under multi user options, activate the flags accordingly. Under user filter, select the users accordingly and update it. To validate the credentials of a user, the user should log in into ESS account via Cosec Web using his or her login ID and newly created password. User can now install Cosec Apta application in his or her mobile device and log in using their respective ESS credentials. The mobile device of the user should be registered using its IMEI number. If the IMEI registration is to be automatically authorized, activate auto authorize IMEI registration flag for a user. For manual authorization, administrator can approve the pending request.
Typically, a QR code contains the encrypted information of COSEC device. To make the information secure, a two-digit alphanumeric key is to be entered in COSEC, which acts as a security key in the encrypted format. To enter the security key, go to System Configuration followed by Global Policy inside Admin Module. In Security option, enter a two-digit security key, 1, 2 or A3 for example. Make sure the COSEC device is added and online. Communication through API is required to mark the attendance using QR code. So we will enable the flag, allow door access through API for a desired device and user. You can also enable it for multiple users under multi-user options. For the device, select the Entry or Exit Access Mode as per the security requirement in the organization. Selecting Entry or Exit Access Mode as API only will enable an employee to enter only after he scans the QR code. Selecting Entry or Exit Access Mode as API then biometrics will ask the employee to show his or her fingerprint or palm credentials after scanning the QR code. To generate the QR code, follow the below mentioned steps. Create a valid data string in the given format. So data string of a COSEC Vega direct door with IP address 192.168.10.15 in entry mode would be as below. Here PDID is 0 for direct door and 1 to 255 for any panel door and mode is 0 for entry and 1 for exit. In order to encrypt this information, go to toolsfornoobs.com. To encrypt matrix COSEC devices information, enter the key as matrix12. Enter the formulated data string in the description. 
Select the algorithm as DES. Select the mode as ECB. Also select encode the output using base64 and hit encrypt this. Copy the result and enter it in. The QR code generator.com Now you can save and use the generated QR code. When your user scans the QR code using Cosec Apta, he will be allowed access. Thank you for watching this video. For further queries, please contact Matrix Technical Support Team.